if you're already subscribed and if you're not hit that subscribe button now so you won't miss another video um today is about an aliexpress haul uh whether or not i felt that it was worth it or not a lot of people hype up the website because it's really cheap and you can get all the dupes from like just straight up designer labels to just all type of things they have household products um on top of clothes and shoes and all those things baby items everything so i sort of got a mixture of everything and i don't know i feel like after the process of ordering and shipping because everything sort of ships separately so you don't get everything at once because there are different vendors on the website um that i really didn't like so you might you know say that's a con and then some of the things that i've seen like on other websites like fashion nova they were there but it's like if i would have ordered at fashion nova i probably would have got it two weeks ago and it all would have came together it might have would have cost a little bit more but versus time and cost who cares so yeah but i guess we can jump right into it so like i said everything came individual i even have a couple things that i just said you know what forget it i'm gonna go ahead and do the uh, video because i didn't want to wait and i'm probably just going to request a refund because it's taking so long um these things <laughs> these are straps i bought two of them because i have a four-year-old and a six-month-old and these are like headbands that you put around the kid's head when they're sleeping in the car and you adjust it here around the seat or the car seat and it straps them <laughs> in there like that so their hair won't be bouncing around when you're driving in their sleep and i thought that was pretty cool and inventive this might have been two bucks this was just like a gadget but i thought this was really neat because when we're driving that's like the main thing especially with my four-year-old it's like her head just gets loose and scary so I think this is gonna be cool. We'll see. I can't wait to try it. Um, this was a bonnet and a do rag set. They're satin, and I'm gonna I'm gonna list all the prices for everything at the bottom in the description box. So I'm not gonna be giving you the prices. I might even run it down at the bottom how much it costs. I'm not sure yet, but yeah, everything. Like I said, this probably might have been five bucks. I think this was a cool purchase because it is real satin. This is the, um, like I said, the do rag here, and it came with a bonnet for the set. Like I said, maybe five bucks. So these things I liked. I was like, oh, that's cool. That's cute. And at first, I had a lot of things in my cart that I wanted to get, but I was like. Once I realized that there were separate vendors and come in at different times, I honestly got disappointed and I didn't even want to order anything else. But, and then this is the bonnet, which you see, that's pretty nice. So I was like, okay, I'm cool. And this, what, this was one of the things that came first. So at first I was like, okay, everything else probably is going to be cool too. Um, I also got... These for my four-year-old and the six-month-old, these are the little, what do you call these, um, turbans. And these are really cute. I can't wait for them to wear it. They tried them on and they fit cute. So these are cute. And they had the mommy and me, or if you want to buy three, whatever. Like I said, again, affordable, really cute, nice material. I was happy about that. I guess now let's move on to the clothes. Um, I was excited about this next item because it feel really soft and it was cute and i'm like okay i read the reviews and everybody said true to size so i wasn't even worried and when i seen it i thought that it was gonna fit and this is shorts mind you this is i want to say i got the extra large or even the one x okay 
The shorts don't fit that bad, as you're going to see in the clip of me wearing it. But the shirt, my daughter who's 16, she also got the same outfit and she has smaller breasts than me. Her shirt fits. But if you have larger breasts, like I said, this is either an extra large or a 1X. And I was hanging all the way out of here. complaint maybe just because of my boob size or how my boobs are shaped why it didn't fit me good but this is really cute and I'm mad that it didn't fit <laughs> again I can't remember how much between between 10 and 20 dollars but yeah that sucks that this didn't fit how I wanted it to fit because <laughs> I was excited about it it's a pretty curvy one I like soft pastel colors so yeah uh, it maybe if you're a smaller breasted person, this will be a good, you know, outfit for you. But if you have big boobs, nine times out of ten, you're gonna hang out unless that's your intention to like show your bra. Um, the next thing I got, <laughs> which I was totally underwhelmed by, was this jumpsuit they call it. It's like a short set. The girls in the ad had it tied up at the on the side or they had it off the shoulder and as you'll see from the insert of me wearing it it does not fit to the point where you can hang it off the shoulder it up on the side but this shirt this material number one I thought it was gonna be like cotton cuz I even heard somebody in the reviews say it was cotton and I'm definitely gonna go back and let them know this is some kind of polyester weirdness that is irregular that's another word to use because it's very irregular <sighs> the shirt is actually the best piece because the pants are so irregular Right in the front, it's like almost how people used to put a crease in their pants. It's like two of two pouches on each leg. It's just poorly made. They, I don't know what to say. But, and then it, it was a three piece. It came with the mask, not even once, just to show you guys. So, again, everything that I'm dissatisfied with, I'm going to write reviews because So again, everything that I'm dissatisfied with, I'm going to write reviews because the, I purchased them because of the good reviews, assuming that people were telling the truth when I don't know if they were getting paid to write the review or not, but the, this right here, when I, because like I said, again, you're waiting for these packages to come separately. I was so upset. <laughs> I was just like, okay, cool, very cool, very cool. There's a shirt that I bought. I actually like this and I feel like um, as long as you have on a good bra, this is going to fit me well, but it is made a bit irregular, but it's real cotton. The letters are, you know, the wording is right <laughs> and all of that. And I like it a lot. This was cool. I think I spent 10 bucks for this. This is also a, a large. Um, I guess it's true to size because I feel like if I would have gotten an extra large, it would have been bigger but still irregular in the spot where I needed it to be bigger. So I still feel like this was a good purchase. 
you just gotta wear it right um i said at least it's real cotton the word the letters the words are spelled correctly yeah so um i like that um one of the last clothes items i bought was a lingerie or a pajama set which looked really nice they have all the colors and it still is really cute but this is not velvet this is something else i don't know what they and this is like the cheapest thinnest lace ever i they don't even have the fringe right it's just that cheap like and the shorts are a bit irregular because if you see how when i have them on on the sides they fit a little funny and again this is an extra large which it didn't fit like but I had read somewhere you might want to size up because it wasn't true to size. But, yeah. I just feel like everything's poorly made. But, I know there's people out there saying, well, what do you expect if it was cheap? Da, 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 da. It's not going to. And the last thing I got was some shoes. Now, mind you, the ad was so cute. I mean, I was like, oh my God, I got furry sandals coming. I'm going to be so excited. I thought um, the first pair were the leopard print now it might even look good from on camera but guys do you see how flat that's okay that gives you an idea and then you go like this look look at that look at that <laughs> there's so much space you might can see on camera but you see this big space they're huge for no reason i mean actually the leopard print doesn't feel as bad it feels pretty soft i'm not gonna lie but it was not the way the ad was advertised i also got the blue pair and this is the one i think that threw me for velcro as you got look at this look you can see it here look at that this this is the paper mache they give you in school to make arts and crafts with this is not shoe material i couldn't believe they sent me this <laughs> i thought it was a joke and yeah even from here you can see but if you look at the ad the shoes look so cute they were less than ten dollars or, or ten dollars so i'm not upset but at the same time don't be fooled but i like i said again i'm going to write a review to let people know hey this is not look at that it's not what <laughs> as advertised and i even seen that they said some people were saying like if you write a bad review that they'll try to block it or something but i'm telling you here now on my review channel look at this don't even be played but all in all, if you want to just buy little knickknacks from there, I, it's okay. It's worth it. But go if you want to go shopping, go to the mall. Go to Fashion Nova. One of these more reputable places and go maybe spend the extra couple of dollars because it's definitely worth it. Um, you don't want to be angry in the end, especially if you thought you were going to get something nice. You got a special occasion. You don't want to wait and then the shipping be late because that's the first problem or you get it in the reviews lied on top of <laughs> the description so yeah that was my experience with aliexpress thank you guys for watching again if you're not already subscribed go ahead and hit the subscription button button so you will not miss another video let me say that one more time if you are not subscribed already hit the subscription button so you won't miss another haul and um also like share tell a friend even if they're a hater tell them hey who cares so um until next time guys i hope you guys stay safe and um take care bye everybody.